welcome everybody to another episode of anvil saga it's it's such a cool game so we're picking up where we left off uh i've just put arthur slash oscar to bed and i've this popped up basically on the last one and it says keep an eye on your character's energy a tired character will make mistakes while forging and may damage the workpiece keep that in mind you guys let me know we go continue send your workers to sleep so that they can retain energy uh, regain energy and more comfortable the bed the faster the character rests okie dokie so then we got to put his bar all the way back up right last episode we made our mine got our mine we got some ore what i'm going to do is we're probably going to go and do that uh again today uh, just quickly and i'll speed it up so you can see him going and we'll try and get at least our 20 ignits ingots ignits ingots whatever they're called and yeah we'll go from there uh right put some music in here and he is going to go hard out right go <laughs> look at this little dude in the back Oop. now we'll cut back in narrator it's hard to work in a forge alone. The village chief has sent you three young men who want to become your apprentice. Oh, lovely. This young man, uh, this young man is new to the village. He came from Glasgowney. Where? Where is he? Hello. Oop, don't know. Oh, there. My name is Theories, Master Blacksmith. Master, eh? Monty is the local trickster and rascalian, uh rascal uh he tries to look like a nobleman in everything he does uh, my name's monty uh my my best friend has a cat called monty big ginger cat very cool uh i've wanted to become your apprentice for ages if you will have me right and this is stone winner of all the fights and wrestling contests in the village i can do all sorts of things and i'm strong as an ox i'm sure i'll be useful okay so which of them is where they become your apprentice? Uh, stone. So what we're going to do? Our relation with Furnace will get worse. Oh, sorry, with, with France will get worse by 10. Current reputation is that. Or reputation with England will improve by 5. Current is 50, right? People don't have much to say about uh, Stone. He's not one of the uh, words, uh, not one for words either, but has consistently proven his craftsmanship and boasts the strength of five men. Right. Monty. Whoa, he has a lot. Oh, the bandits will improve by 15 current. Uh, I've heard that Monty is a bit of a shady character quite a few times, but no one had ever caught him stealing. However, word of his cunning has spread far and wide, so he can be very useful. Right. Or we've got this one which will boost france but england will go down by 10 points mm. so it's no surprise that uh a fellow countryman but he'll follow my lead i'm his master after all, all right i think we'll go for the first guy yeah i think we'll go for the first guy thank you for trusting me master i won't let you down you now have an apprentice he will need a room where he can rest after hard work. Keep an eye on his level of fatigue and pay his salary on time. Your apprentice skills will improve with time. And now let's get get to it. Accept and successfully complete five orders with Ferris. Help. Whoa. Okay. So send Thera to Smith the orders. We click on him. The forges. The forger's workers will demand to be paid to continue work. A refusal will upset them, and if they uh, and if their mood drops further, the apprentice will leave the forge. Okay, if you want to get rid of a worker, you don't need to remove the stairs to the cellar. You can just fire them. Okay. Uh, so click on here, and we go over here. Is that right? Yep. Oh. And then you, Arthur, are going to go up here. Yeah, sure. And we'll go here. Whoa, that was some glitch. You are a smith, right? In the name of his majesty, the different uh, Dauphine of France, I authorized to collect the lands tax for the goods of our country. 
all of you just prey on honest people no matter what you call yourself are you going to pay or not france demands that you pay 12 coins as the land tax yeah sure keeping good with them at the moment all right let's open it up you're going to smith double it uh no 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 you was sorry i clicked on you didn't mean to uh right let's do this one so he's gonna do that and then you are gonna come down and work in the mine again and yep i can do that one that's fine wish i could find a few coins Ooh, i like it i like it a lot oh i can zoom out yay okay uh yep we'll do that one that one's got uh less ore on it i've got enough okay, let's speed that up a tiny bit and have we got four we have not but we shall uh on that one very hot he can do some of that while he's doing that lovely Speed it up. Speed it up. Okay, so uh you sorry, you can go here. All about management, people. All about management. Stop eating! Oh, I guess you are might be tired. Customers with different factions do not like each other. If you make an order for a soldier, knight, or hunter from one faction, it will worsen your reputation with the other. Okay. The same applies to witches and monks, however, since they don't have their eyes and ears in the province, I thought that, I thought you meant that they didn't have their eyes and ears, that's weird, reputation only decreases if a member of the opposing faction witnesses the production of the order. Bandits, that is, the people of Lukua, uh, the just, do not like to be refused. Each refusal will worsen your reputation with them. Okay. You will receive different bonuses and penalties depending on your reputation level with different factions for example england can generously reward That was a big sneeze. Okay. Um, for example, England can generously reward you with money every day. The bandits can eliminate, uh, intimidate your workers so that they don't have to pay them wages. Oh, now you tell me. You can take a look at your current reputation bonuses and penalties in the order journal. Right. Be careful as reducing your reputation with the ruling faction to zero will lead to the most dire of consequences. Okie dokie. uh wait 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 what happened ah okay um you still need to do that uh i need to turn this off and i need to sorry uh you're sure we can complete that you can go here oh you are not gonna be able to complete that i'm so sorry madam i'm so sorry yeah, you grumpy. I oh, know. Sorry. <laughs> Alright, we're going to open it quickly. We're going to speed this up. Wait for one other person. Oh, sorry. Oh, damn it. Okay. Let's wait for him to get some more ore. And then you... Oh, you already did it. Sweet. Let's bring someone in. Aha. Who is this? uh sure and then let's close it so that no one else comes along uh oops sorry just missed we here right speed 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 do, 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 do. uh now we were supposed to press t weren't we here we go uh view the anvil saga so this is arthur uh this is like the story uh current quests you have no current quests view current orders view completed orders view statistics close the journal of oh, factions here we go so supply issues englishmen turned away uh, turn away caravans heading to for your province every day some goods in your stores will be missing okay and then these are these guys 
Oh, that's because I... Like, faction went down. Okay, cool. Close the journal. Carry on. Uh, by the way, have you heard the news? <clears throat> Sorry. By the way, have you heard the news that um, the English have planned another assault? Lots of towns have uh, already given up their keys and they seem to have the Flemish support as well. More than anything, I hope that the war doesn't reach this place or both of us will end up doing hard labor instead of hard work. Right. Can you do this as well at the same time? You cannot. Just one. Okay, you need to rest. I think your energy is getting a little bit low, sir. And then yours is okay. Your hunger is down. But we will try and get some ore. Uh, right, let's speed this sucker up and I'll be right back. Right, apparently workers need to be fed. Yeah, you know. Uh, a hungry worker will make mistakes while forging and might damage the workpiece. If a worker remains unfed for a long time, they might starve to death. To cook food, you need to have enough provisions in storage. It can be purchased from a merchant. Right. Ah, oh, also need a place for him to stay. Ah, right. Let's build house. Um, let's go here. Ooh, that's a hundred coins. Okay, well, we're just going to put a bed in there. Uh, another bed. Wooden bed. Still better than sleeping on the floor. Comfort level. Ooh, that's 50 coins. 25. Oh, I can't put it down. No. Uh, oh, well, that sucks. Okay. Well, you're just not going to have any bed at the moment. You're just going to have to share a bed. Uh, let's escape out of here. And let's go to the food. What's our provisions? Is this provisions? This is our theme. You can hear the dog in the background. Uh, the dog over the fence is barking to say hello, and she decided that that's what she's going to do as well. Uh, open factions, no provisions. Provisions, what? Da, 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 da. Right. So you are fully good to go. You can come over here and do some that. But you do need to eat. Is that what you're doing now? Yes. Okay, you're cooking. Good. I guess you do that automatically. There is no food in the cabinet. Buy some. Oh, okay. Uh, food. Food, food, food. So this is ore. This is more ore. Uh, food. Here we go. Food for workers. This is cheaper to buy that. Okay, cool. Right. Buy. He's going to eat. How much does that replenish? Everything. Lovely. Who are you? Oh, lovely. Thank you. Thank you. Love your work. Thank you very much. Right. Uh, that adds more food in here. Lovely. Oh. Okay, it stores three. Right, so I brought three. Great. So it's now night time. Uh, this person probably is going to need a sleep. So he can do the last lot of ore and then he can have a sleep. Because he's getting a little bit slow. And then go here. Cool. Awesome. You are smithing. We have enough. Uh, we can nearly open up. Yeah, let's, let's open up the shop. You are in here. There's people that come at night time, which is totally fine. Yes. And then this one is... I think... How do you tell if he is... Bandit or not? 
How do you tell? I have no idea. Oh, there. Accept the order. Completing this order will improve your relationship with the bandits. Sure. This one. Just accept the order in general. Awesome. And then let's close this sucker as well. Oh, no, no. Come back. Oh, no. We, we, we still got stuff. Come here. Hello. Oh, yeah. Old dude. Come on, old dude. I'm taking ages. Come on. Come with your walking stick. All right. Uh, let's do this one and then so that's two and then no uh, I don't want you to be in debt cool. and then turn off this one awesome I've never seen this merchant in our village before Ooh. go and find out who he is and what he wants hey lad call the owner I didn't come here all the way from to talk to an apprentice. Get a move on, my boy. How do you know that he's not the owner? What's going on? Oh, okay. He's coming. Have you come from afar? How can I help? I came from the south and I'm setting up some trade links. I can bring you whatever you want for the best price. Uh, steel to pre uh, precision instruments want to work together. That might be good. Don't, don't even think of refusing. I barely escaped the bandits myself. Don't even think of refusing. Okay. The roads are unsafe and thieves and bandits gather like vultures where armies have passed recently. You should agree as I'm the bravest merchant of those prepared to offer their services to you. Bandits are all we uh, are all we need right now. If you're talking business, would you be so kind as to take an order from me? What should I make for you? Right. Uh, let's without a good supplier, there is no smithy business. If I can complete the order well enough. Antonio will supply me with uh, goods from faraway lands. Right. Complete this order. Da, da, da. You need to craft this. So does it does it matter? Like, what's what's the difference? Okay. Cool. Uh, right. You guys. Hello. You guys get onto it. And you get back down here. We need more ore, oh, people. More oh. I know you're tired and you're hungry, but you'll go and eat eventually, I guess. Cool. Arthur, what are you doing? Some. Awesome. You are going to be on here. And we will speed that bad boy up. Go, go, go. Get the ore. Oh. So two ore per time? Is it? Must be. How do you get more ore per time? Two. One ore. Ah, it's just random. Okay. Um. At least it's got a long clock time. Okay. We're going to speed these up. I'll have to get four, five, six, nine ore all up. And then I'll be back. Ooh. Okay. What's going on? Uh, hey there, Arthur. It's been a while. Ooh, love the mustache. Uh, have you decided to follow your father's footsteps? Hey, Jean. Uh, if not me, then who? How is your smithy doing? Uh, quite well off, thank you. Uh, that said, my father recently passed away, as like yours. So now I'm just Jean Jacques. Jacques? Jacques? Whatever, however you say. It is all the will of a god. Of God. I have quite grand prospects for this smithy. Oh, my condolences. Uh, why visit our humble smithy? Can't handle the orders. Uh, you're handing, uh, handling them quite well. Quite well indeed. I just wanted to see how you're doing. There are only two smithies left in the province. Neither of us really need competition in times like these. What would you say if I offered to buy your smithy? You'll be my right-hand man. With your talent, we could be magnificent. 
Thank you for the offer. My father didn't work himself to the bone just for me to sell the forge. Yeah, yeah. I didn't uh, didn't think you'd give it to us so easily. Well, next fair we'll see you how you compare. By the way, I saw uh, Finlay's daughter Olivia a few days ago. She has blossomed into quite the beauty. Be sure to pay them a visit. I'm not surprised. She has always been fair. Why do you care? Well, you know, just remember how you look. Uh, look back at her at the fair. Finley uh, will only agree that she marries a rich man. He's a smart one. Uh, so don't get your hopes up and do think about my offer to buy the forge. Thank you for the advice, Jean. Uh, glad to see you as always. I must take my leave. The work isn't going anywhere and I don't have the time to wander around and get up people's business. Very good lad, Arthur. Shame you'll have to work in the fields uh, before long. Have fun with your smithy. Right. So, uh, he is needing sleep. Okay, cool. You are pretty much going to go here. And you are going to go sleep. Cool. And he is making stuff. That should replenish my energy. Oh, I have to make lots of those. Okay, so, whew, right. Make three of those, so that's two each one. Yes, or are you just randomly making all of them? No, you're just making this one. Cool. Uh, right, I have run out. Actually, you need a smith. Right. Go, go, go. Da, 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 da. Now, while the worker was in the mine, a whole nest of spiders fell on him. Whoa. Whenever he works in the mine, there's a 10% chance of him looking around to watch for these creatures. Okay. God fearing, there's a 15% chance that this worker might stop to pray while working okay this worker used to be a fencer so he knows full well how to make a deadly weapon right what about this one uh god bearing gold miner a worker has a five percent chance of finding a gold nugget while working in the mine this worker has a real talent for smithing his experience grows 30 percent faster okay movement speed while carrying is bad okay so he's getting very tired and I need Arthur to now go go here and you to go there and have a sleep. Ah, oh, right. This is very cool. I'm loving this game. This game is cool. <sighs> yes. Awesome. All right. Uh, I think we will leave it there. I'm going to quickly get our uh, ore up uh and yeah we'll keep it going and if you haven't already like comment subscribe you'll be notified when new videos come out i'm on my way to 250 subs i think at the time of this recording we're at like 147 or something or 146 can't remember so if you haven't subscribed and you want to be part of that journey click the subscribe button it's free and you will be notified oh yeah sure uh you will be notified when new videos come out and yeah it's these are cool we're getting new new games uh every now and again and so i check them up on the channel you guys tell me if you like them by liking and watching and all that kind of jazz but yeah i hope you guys enjoyed the video you guys have a good night or day depending on where you are and i will see you in the next one bye